So Change, it's, a, it's an interesting piece. It's a, it's a chandelier. It's made of over 7,000 teacup handles that are strung together in long chains. That's the kind of physicality of the piece. But the interactivity of the piece is, uh, is based upon a, a text messaging platform. So anybody in the world can text message the chandelier and uh, uh, they can change the color. So they can interact with the chandelier from anywhere in the world. It has, uh, it's, our, it's all RGB LEDs. Uh, that are uh, controlled with the micro um, controller, and uh, yeah. So the fun thing is, is you phone a number, type in a color, and the chandelier changes that color. Or you type in a phrase, or you type in a word, and the algorithm sorts it out. I really consider myself a potter first and foremost. That's my training. So I'm making these objects that go into people's homes that are they're very intimate. You put that cup to your lips. Uh, you develop a relationship with these handmade objects. They last in your home for many, many years. When I started to make these larger sculptural works, what I realized is I was missing that in intimacy. I wasn't really connecting with people in this personal way, uh, beyond my ego. Um, and so this idea of kind of uh, connecting with people through their phones uh, became really important to me because everybody's got this phone now and I thought, well, wouldn't it be interesting if I can use that platform, which is counterintuitive for a potter, to, to reach people, to get that experience back again. So that's really where it came from. The last exhibition I had of this chandelier, uh, we had text messages from every continent on Earth except Antarctica. 